Welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to go over the different types of Mary stems that can be found in plants. Mary stems are areas in a plant where the tissue is made up of undifferentiated cells, also known as meristematic cells. These cells are capable of cell division and eventually differentiation into a specific tissue type that makes up the different tissues of the plant. There are two main groupings of Mary stems primary Mary stems and secondary Mary stems. Primary Mary stems are Mary stems that are formed during embryogenesis at the opposing poles of the plant embryo. Once the plant has germinated and started growing outside of the seed, the primary Mary stems are responsible for providing the cells that differentiate to form the primary tissues of the plant. The primary Mary stems are the apical Mary stems, both the shoot apical Mary stems and the root apical Mary stems. The shoot apical Mary stems are located at the tips of shoots and plants. These Mary stems go on to form the stems and leaves of the plant. For more detail, check out my video on the shoot apical Mary stem. The root apical Mary stems are located at the tips of roots and plants. These Mary stems go on to form the roots and continued root growth. For more detail on the root apical Mary stem, check out my video on it. Secondary Mary stems are Mary stems that develop on the mature plant tissue system to become Mary stomatic again. There are a range of secondary Mary stems that can occur in plants. One kind of secondary Mary stem are the variants that are derived from the vegetative shoot apical Mary stem. One of these variants is the axillary Mary stem. Axillary Mary stems are located in the axils of leaves. They go on to form the tissues that form new branches. Other variants derived from the vegetative shoot apical Mary stem are the inflorescence and floral Mary stems. Inflorescence and floral Mary stems are formed from the vegetative shoot Mary stems when the plant is induced to begin flowering. This transformation of the vegetative Mary stem can be straight into a floral Mary stem, but in many cases it will transform into an inflorescence Mary stem first. Inflorescence Mary stems go on to form bracts and floral Mary stems. Floral Mary stems go on to produce the floral organs and whorls, the sepals, the petals, the stamens, and the carpels. Another form of secondary Mary stem, one that is not derived from the vegetative Mary stems, is the intercalary Mary stem. Intercalary Mary stems are only found in monocots. They are located at the base of nodes and at the base of leaf blades. When at the base of nodes, they aid in the growth of the plant in the form of elongation of the stem, such as in bamboo plants. When at the base of leaf blades, they aid in the regrowth of the leaf from the base, such as in grasses. This allows them to keep growing even when they get cut. Lateral root Mary stems, also known as branch root Mary stems, are another type of secondary Mary stem. These Mary stems form from the pericycle in the root and have the same structure as the primary root Mary stem. These Mary stems go on to form the lateral roots as well as adventitious roots. Another type of secondary Mary stem found in plants are the lateral Mary stems. These Mary stems are located within the already established stem. They cause growth of the stem laterally, so a growth in the diameter of the plant stem. The vascular cambium is a type of lateral Mary stem. The vascular cambium is found in plants that go through secondary growth. The vascular cambium produces secondary xylem and phloem in the stem. This forms woody tissues in the plant. The cork cambium is another type of lateral Mary stem. These Mary stems are located within the cells of the cortex and secondary phloem. They go on to produce the cork cells that form the periderm, also known as the bark. The periderm, aka bark, forms a protective layer on the plant. And that concludes this video on the different types of Mary stems. Thank you for watching. If you want to support this channel, please subscribe and check out more of my videos.